It's me! <laughs> so, it's been about two months, and I'm not gonna be explaining slash spewing out excuses why I haven't been here, but let me tell you that my holiday was great, and I hope yours was nice as well. Today, I'm actually gonna be talking about something interesting. I'm gonna show you how to do this. I know that it looks like a very complicated hairstyle and whenever I do this hairstyle in school, people are always like, how many hours did you do your hair? And the thing is, the amount of hours I spent doing this hairstyle is the same amount of hours I spent making fun of people who want to look great, which is zero. So, if you know me, you know that I am a big fan of Lolita. I love the book. I love the movies and I love Dolores Hayes' style in the 997 movie. This braid is called the Milkmaid braid, but I like to call it the Lolita braid because it's one of the hairstyles that she wore the most during the movie. So let's start. So the first thing you do is make twin braids. The braid should start right above your ear. Extra tip, if you have extra silky, slippery, or very straight hair, I recommend applying hairspray, gel, or wax before you style your hair, and even after, for support hold. At this point, you can choose to secure your braids with an elastic. Once your braids are done, pull one braid over your head and place them across like a headband. I'm going to use a hairpin to secure them in place. But don't pin them down all the way just yet. Now, take the other braid and place it in front of the first braid. Again, make sure they're nice and secure with bobby pins. Now, if you have short or medium length hair, the braids would go across your head just perfectly. But if you have extra long hair like me, there would be some left over. So, we tuck them behind the braids. Again, pins are your friend. Tucking and hiding them under the braids would work too. If you find some parts uneven, all you have to do is thin them down. And it should look something like this. And that's it! I hope you learned something and I'm gonna see you in my next video. Bye!